bola. Shoot at the gasoline. Haven't got a chance. I've got a high powered rifle. We slip over the side quietly and we may get away with it. Let's swim for it. Them. Now we'll get back and report. Come on. of getting to the Viceroy. I have an idea. If I can get back to the radio room at Thompson's Hotel, maybe I can repair the radio and we can get outside that way. It's worth a try, Terry. I've got to get back to my father. He's badly hurt. Yes, that's right. We'll take you there first. Your father's safe in my shack. I take you there now. Wait, we both take her there. Me number one man, right? Swell, that's a way out. Be careful, Normandy. We'll be all right, too. It's difficult to translate. But I can read some of it. Well, we'll read it, Doctor. Read it. When the moon god's face lights the east temple wall, follow the shadow across the courtyard to the hidden stone door. The way to the treasure. Uh, what does it say of the treasure? Uh, nothing as yet. Uh, I have much to decipher. Uh, well, hurry, man. Hurry. Read it. What's fine? He's talking again. That's a fine. I'll be back in a moment, Doctor. Keep working on it. Bravo! Bravo! Not Bravo! Yes. Good news, Pine. Got an important message from Wing Poo. Stanton and the boys restored the entire party. Drake, his daughter, and Ryan and the kid. All wiped out. Oh. Are you certain the message mentioned young Lee? Sure, he was with them. They were all blown up in the river. Stanton carried out your orders. Oh, I heard you lying, murderer. You promised me my boy was safe. Now, he is safe, Doctor. What you heard? It's what? useless to lie, Fang. I heard the entire party was wiped out and by your orders. Ah, you're mistaken, Doctor. The truth is there was a native uprising at Wing Po, and Drake's place was attacked. Your son and Ryan were there, but they escaped, I give you my word. Now let us get back to the scroll. Never. I'll finish with you here and now. for these people being killed. Now, you get a report ready for the vice royal that'll put us in the clear. Why, that's putting me on the spot. I won't do it, Stanton. You'll do what Fang says. You'll write a report and that'll beat anybody else to the punch. Tell them there was a native uprising. The Drake's Ryan and young Lee was chased to the river and killed. You've got order restored. Everything's quiet. Understand? Yes, but what about those two Chinese servants of Ryan's? Yeah, I'd forgotten about them. They dropped out of sight. Probably lying low, but I think I know where to find them. The big fella's got a shack close by. We'll go down and watch them. Now get busy on that report. The old Spang takes action. Okay. All right, boys, you can go. We're all right now. We go outside and watch.
Close the door. Down. for me, but I'll hide if it'll satisfy you. See who's inside. Hey, move it! Look over here, sir! Don't touch it! Sucks! I just saw the drink cut out. Oh, you're crazy. I tell you, I just saw her go out of the window. Out of this window here. And she went that way. That means that Ryan and Lee are alive. Not yet, you fool. She'll lead us to him. I'll get the boys. Blackie, you have your gun. Take these two to the warehouse and tie them up. Well, you're not going to leave me there alone. Well, them. that gun will handle that up. You two come with me. All right, you get up. Just a couple of minutes more and we're ready to call out. Oh, Terry, that's great. It's a cinch. They're in your place. Let's get the girl before she gets in. I wouldn't do that. <laughs> you got the keys? Yeah. All right, we'll take her to the warehouse and lock her up. You two stay here. It's working, Pat. Put in the call. Here we go. Wing Fu calling the Viceroy. 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 Keep calling, Terry. I'll hold them all. They better work. Wing Fu calling the Viceroy. Oh, Viceroy. Come in, Viceroy. Come in, Viceroy. Viceroy. Viceroy answering. Come in, Wing Fu. From Master Hang. Dr. Lee has escaped. Go on, go on, Jack, go away! Shut up! If Lee's loose, maybe Fang will want these two for bait. Take them to that warehouse and tie them up with the others. I'll report to Fang. Come on, Sir Paul. Come along, get some of us. Let me go! It's all a fine looking lot. All dressed up like a bunch of chickens. <laughs> you know what I'm wondering about is what they're going to do to you. <laughs> Shut up! Every one of you. Boy, I wish you didn't have that gun. Yeah, but I got it. <laughs> Sir, 
Vic Stoop here is a magician. Oh, yeah? Want to see a trick? I've seen everything. <laughs> yeah, but, but this one's a beauty. Show him, Stoop. Ah, that ain't so hot. What? Hey, you, you, put your hands behind you. You'll show me tricks, will you? Now, let's roll on you. I've got six tricks in here, and if you start anything, I'll show you every one of them. Now, you turn around. Stoop, turn around, he'll tell you. Tie you to where you won't get out of it. Boy, Terry. Terry, I can untie Normandy. Nice going, big stoop. Well, what are we gonna do? We're gonna get out of here fast. Connie and Stoop tie him so he can't get away. We do. You know, I could get a swell picture of him if the light in here was back. Stop now, Terry. Well, it looks like there's no chance of getting word to the Viceroy now. Well, then the thing to do is to get to the jungle and find Dad. If I know your Dad, the first thing he would do is locate the Dragon Lady, believing us to be with her. At the Temple of the Dawn? No, at the Ruined Temple. We could start from there. You mean Fang's hideout? Why not? That's the last place in the world he'd think of looking for us. Stanton put a loudspeaker and a record in the God Mara there. Maybe we could get enough material together and make a record for the Dragon Lady. What can I do? Look. You can go with us, and as soon as we check by Fang's hideout, we can take you to the Dragon Ladies for safety. Your dad's all right. Oh, I, I hate to be such a bother. Oh, you're no bother. Pat likes you around. Well, him tag tag. What do you say, Normandy? Well, if you think it's best, I'll go. Good. Oh, swell. Come on, let's get out of here. What did it say? Fang say if we near hide out, to go there and wait for Stanton. He come with important orders. Ryan and others in jungle. On your feet. Someone was started. We're near there. I think I got enough. Oh, let's get going. Oh, wait a minute. Maybe with this amplifier, I can rig up a remote control speaker. Good. Maybe we can use it. Fang's men remove the talking record from the god Mara. Fang discovers the trick. Terry is cornered, but Pat draws the Tigerman away. He joins Pat at the ammunition hut. They drive back the Tigerman with grenades. Fang grabs a rifle, fires, bullets rip through the walls, tear into a powder keg. Terry and Pat are trapped as a great explosion destroys the hut. See, no escape. Next thrilling chapter of Terry and the Pirates.
Try it, open it up. Wait a minute. We better make sure. Dragon Lady's high priest, and like you, an enemies of Fang. Yes, I recognize you. Where is the Dragon Lady? I will take you to her. Your son and his friend has helped her to a secret place of safety. Good. What are we supposed to do? Wait here and starve to death? We were ordered to watch the Dragon Lady's villa and watch it we will. Keep both eyes open. Stu, bring that inside the house. Everything's going to be okey dokey. We've got all the equipment we need. Stu, you go out and watch with Connie. Me do. Eyes open like you. Some of my most trusted followers have been here. They report unrest among the people caused by the disappointment that the god Mara has not spoken again. Terry, put that gun down. You might get hurt. If the god Mara should speak again... Pat! Thanks, pirates! <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Oh, boys, they're all worn out. Tie these fellows up. Okay. Terry! Dad! Your Highness! Terry, take the folks on upstairs. Oh, Pat, let me stay. Terry, go on, take the folks upstairs. I'll take care of these guys. without this scroll which he stole from the god Mara. Well, so you got him, huh? Number one boy do good work. <laughs> Connie, lock these boys up in the shed. Stoop, take this gun. If one of those boys makes a move, shoot and shoot to kill. Me do. Come on. You heard what he said. Come on. But what are your plans? We must act quickly. Your high priest is going to inflame the people to demand another speech from Mara. Well, it won't work. Stan, we'll just put another phonograph record in the statue. Then we must lose no time. The god Mara must not be able to speak again for Fang. If the people demand to hear Mara's voice, then Fang fails. Oh, I said that'll mean curtains for Fang. Certainly. We've got to get that record out of the statue. Well, I'm with you on that, partner. If we could go disguised as leopard men, we ought to be able to make it. Why, that's a cinch. You know those guys we captured? I'll get their outfits. Well, what's holding us up? Right. I shall go with you part of the way. I know a direct path. Good luck, Hen. Take good care of Terry. You can depend on it, Dr. Lee. Now, to get back to this scroll. You know this is one of the most valuable records that have been discovered in ages. Here you are, Pat. I picked you out one of the best ones. Boy, I can hardly wait to see what I'm going to look like in this. Connie, you be sure and keep a good watch. Yes, sir. This is very valuable. It's your property and should be in your care. Thank you, Doctor. One move. You'll be dead. Sit down. They're coming, Pat. They're coming up the trail. Get ready. They've gone. What? Oh! Walker, you gotta beat those guys to Fang and tell them what happened. 
Frank, here's your reward. Good boy. Come on, can't we get out of here? No, we're going to stick around. Prisoners all gone, escaped. What? Dre and Lady's servant let them free. Oh. Then they'll beat Pat and Terry to the temple. They must be warned. Big Stoop and me do that. Travel fast, maybe catch up with leopard men on trail. Yes, you can make better speed than I can. Hurry, go. Well, I'm glad this is over with. Yeah, they're working us to death. Oh, stop your whining. Leave the phonograph equipment outside and take the ammunition in there. Grenades over there and the powder on that side. All right, join the others. Coming here disguised as leopard man to get the records out of the statue Mara. And the natives are demanding that the god Mara speak at once. A very clever plan, but not clever enough. I shall see Stanton. Ryan and Young Lee are on their way here disguised as leopard man. They may be here now. Hey, you two, step forward. Go and stand guard over the statue of Mara, that no one come near it. Uh, Bucky. Yes, sir. Go to the temple. Tell Gore to take the gorilla and help guard Mara. It is the record those fellows are after. Yes, sir. What a freak, Pat. They sent us to guard the statue. Yes, get in there quick and get that photograph record out. Hurry it up, Terry. Hurry it up. We will trap Brian and Lee. Check up on everyone. All right, men, take off those headpieces. Uh, where are Morgan and Hayes? You sent them to guard the statue. Oh, yes, sir, I did. I had forgotten. Look! Morgan and Hayes! Now, what happened to you? Ryan and Lee slugged us on the trail. Then it must have been them that we sent to the statue! Harry, they're after us! Stay in there, I'll be kind of away!
bought the ammunition. That is what I intended, though. There's plenty more ammunition at my headquarters. This should be the end of our young friends. Commander Fang Powerless, Terry and Pat go to Fang's hideout to destroy his ammunition. They overpower a guard, locate the ammunition, set and light a fuse. They're making their escape when Fang's men enter. They fight desperately but are driven back, struck to the floor. Crunch brings up his gun to finish them. This is only one of the many thrills in the fatal mistake. Next thrilling chapter of Terry and the Pirates. what I intended, though. There's plenty more ammunition at my headquarters. This should be the end of our young friends. Finding us here. Those roughnecks. Oh, gee, they thought we were killed. Now you tipped them all. Fang had that ammunition brought here to use on the Dragon Lady's people in case of a revolt. They deliberately blew up the hut trying to get us. That means they have more somewhere else. If we could only destroy the rest of it. Maybe it's at Fang's headquarters. We wouldn't be taking much of a chance. Most of his men are here. We'll do it. I've got to locate the direction first. <laughs> Cop, it's never meant much to me. Southwest. Well, they 
got away again. Impossible. The hut was entirely destroyed. They got out before it went up. We saw them and lost them in the jungle. They destroyed the record out of the statue, but we got pieces out of the wreckage. Did you bring the equipment to make more records? Yeah. But Ryan and young Lee found more equipment in the hideaway. If they're smart enough, they might be able to make some records of their own. Mm. I see their game. They are inciting the natives to demand that the god Mara speak before we can make another record. This is what we will do. Brunch. You take your men and go to that hideaway of the Dragon Lady. That place Walker told about. Bring the Dragon Lady and Dr. Lee here. We will hold them as hostage to keep her people in check. Yes, sir. Come on, Harris. Hey, this place is too quiet for me. It looks like a trap. I'll soon find out. Hey, don't throw that grenade. Anybody in there that had roused him? Yeah. Looks like we're gonna get a break at last. Be won't be of any more use to Fang. There's only one more place Fang would keep his ammunition and explosives. His hideaway. We'll go there quick. We might as well finish this job. We'll have that guy Fang on the run yet. We hear big boom. Plenty worried. We come to see. Maybe you need help. Well, why did you leave Dad and the Dragon Lady? Fang's men get away. Dragon Lady says to warn you. They think you need big stoop. You go back to the Dragon Lady's place and tell them we destroyed the phonograph record in the God Mara. And that we mean to finish up the job of destroying all the ammunition in Fang's hideout. You got that? Have got. Would I forget? Number two man, remember. You stay there till we get back, understand? We're going on to Fang's hideout and we'll join you. Yes, there's not only treasure beneath your temple, but records of the early history of your people that prove that they had a civilization equal to that of ancient Greece. We know of many secret places in the temple, but none such as you describe. When I have finished the translation, I will give you the key. 
Please believe me, I am not interested in any treasure. I believe you, Doctor. Dr. Lee's along with the dragon lady, the drake girl, and the high priest. It'll be a cinch to grab them. Make a hit with the boss, too. Yeah. It's worth a try. Just our luck. That big guy's worse than dynamite. We'll have to wait. Servants. Did you get to Pat and Terry in time to warn them? Oh, no. They got their verse and break phonograph record all to pieces. Good. Then they go to Fang's headquarters and blow it up. Bang! Are they all right? Sure. Now they go to Fang's hideout and blow it up, too. Bigger bang! That's great. If they can do that, then there's a chance we can attack Fang on even terms and regain your throne. Oh, it's too good to be true. The native unrest is spreading. You've got to work faster, Stanton. I'll have it ready. Yes, what is it? Downs just arrived from headquarters. He says Ron and young Lee blew up the powder room and wrecked the place. Then all the ammunition you have left is at the hideaway. And I'll bet they're heading for it right now. We've got to beat them to it. You surprise me, Stanton. You have some brains after all. I was beginning to doubt it. Drama message to Crunch. Tell him to get to the hideaway at once. Never mind the Queen. Terry Lee and Ryan are on their way there to destroy it. Yes. Is ordering his leopard men to go to his hideaway. He knows that Terry and Pat are going there to destroy it. Oh. I wish Fan would make up his mind. Tell Fan we're on our way to the hideout. Crunch answers. He's on his way to the hideout. Oh, if we can! And there's nothing we can do to save them. Yes, there is. I'll try to get there in time to warn them. Honey, stoop. Come with me. Don't you leave the school. I think both of you will be safe here. I'm sure all of Fang's men have heard the message and will head for the hideout. Oh, please. Don't think of us now. Your son is in danger. We'll be all right. Do what you can to save them. God, this well. Come on, boys. What a break. They're leaving the women alone with the old priest. We must hide this. Don't stop nothing and nobody will get hurt. We're going to take you back to Fang. My cloak. Her cloak. <laughs> take them out. I'll uh, search the place. Go on, get going. Got a guard there. Yeah. Well, two time. It's worth a try. Works. Let's share the power now. 
down to the fuse. Normandy and the high priest prisoners in the temple. Terry, Pat, and the dragon lady come to free them. They unlock the cells, but Fang has expected this move and is watching. Unaware that they are followed, Lee's party goes to an underground passage to locate the secret treasure room. They reach the hidden room. The secret of the temple is in their grasp. But can Terry and his friends escape Fang's trap? See the Pyre of Death. Next thrilling chapter of Terry and the Pirates. Let's get 
back the temple. to keep you from ever obtaining the scroll or the treasure. Ah, then you have the scroll. That is all I wanted to know. Search them. Search them and see if they have an ancient scroll. Sure you weren't followed? I don't know. Terry, take a look out the window. 
Fang has sure to suspect that the scroll is here. We must get it away quickly. Yes, in Normandy, too. Oh, I forgot. I was only thinking of my own troubles. We must free them. You bet we will. And be Fang, too. Won't we, Pat? Yeah, well, at least we can try. Well, I sure gave Mara plenty to say, didn't I? Yes, and just in time, too. The natives have been demanding that the god Mara speak to them again. I got it, boss. And what do you think? Pat Ryan and the kid were with the dragon lady when we got there. We had a tough time getting that thing. Then they were not killed at the hideaway? No. Well, that doesn't matter now. Of course, you saw to it in person that this time they were... No, you see, I... Uh, you just said to get the scroll. Yes, and... yes, I understand. It would be too much to expect, Joe, to think for yourself. They will not be free long. What do you mean? They will be certain to make an attempt to rescue Dr. Lee and the others. We will make it easy for them. Here is my plan. Well, that's one of your men. Yes. Let us pray that he is still loyal. Vito. My queen. You wish to help? Hand me the keys to the cells. Here. Here, Terry, you take this. You get your dad, I'll take care of the others. Right. You better leave. They'll kill you for your loyalty to me. I never expected to see you again. I'll have you out of here in a jiffy, Dad. Hurry, Pat. Hurry. Now, Dad, the Dragon Lady and Pat figure that the only way to get rid of Fang is to get the treasure, if there is one, and take it to the Viceroy for safety. Dr. Lee, you are the only one who can read that scroll. What did it say of the treasure? The scroll mentions a hidden chamber in which the hand of Mara is enshrined. Then the legend must be true. Yes. When I was a child, the old priest spoke of the golden hand of Mara. It has been lost for centuries, but the belief is whoever holds his hand will guide the destiny of Mars people. It's possible that the lost treasure is also in this chamber. Well, let's find it and beat Fang to it. I think I know the way. No, oh, wait. Those fools will lead us right to the treasure. Wait. That passage is the one mentioned in the scroll. This should be it. Cloven hoof. The key to the treasure room. Well, how do you work it, Dad? Just a moment. You turn the cloven hoof and it releases a catch. Open it. This hour that the sun strikes here. Well, does the golden hand have anything to do with the treasure? Well, yes, everything. The scroll said the golden hand of Mara points the way to the hidden treasure. Why, then it must be buried behind that wall. Yes. From that point, we dig through to the inner room. There we will find what we seek.
Thank you. If one of you makes a move, my men will shoot you down. Please! No bloodshed. I care nothing for the treasure. The boy got away. Good old Terry. He doesn't matter. Let him go. Take these others away. Stanton. Crunch. This golden hand is merely a sample of the wealth that lies beyond that wall. All that I promised you. Yes. Oh, Stanton, it will take hours to break through that wall. In the meantime, the natives must be pacified. We will place all of the prisoners on the sacrificial altar. Get the phonograph record ready. Crunch, get some tools to break through that wall. Yes. In the meantime, I will stand guard over the golden hands of Mara. What are you doing? I'm getting ready to put the record in the god Mara. Mm, good. Ah, a keg of powder. Marvelous. Where did you get it? It's the one I brought along to use on the natives when we first took over the temple. Mm. Have you found the Lee kid yet? No, but he is of no consequence. He can do nothing alone. Come. that our god Mara speak to us again. Look, my people, the golden hand of Mara. Token of his favor and proof that I am your chosen leader. Make her speak to us. Very well. I will do as you wish. Oh, great God, Mara, your people beg of you to speak to them. Hear your God. Mara commands you to place your trust in Fang. Failure to do so will bring dire punishment upon you and yours. Mara has been betrayed by the Dragon Lady and the foreign enemies. They must be put to death. You have heard. Oh, Mara, we obey you. We shall offer in sacrifice the enemies of your people. No, no. by Fang's men, Terry and Pat reach the mic connected to the loudspeaker. Pat speaks, saying that his is the voice of Mara. The astounded natives believe that they hear the real voice of their god. At Pat's command, they turn on Fang's men. But Fang locates the boys, knocks Pat unconscious. For mystery, thrills, and danger, see The Secret of the Temple, the exciting and last chapter of Terry and the Pirates.
You have heard. Omara, we obey you. We shall offer in sacrifice the enemies of your people. All right, all right. will soon explode. Get back! We shall soon be rid of all of them. All of them. The way open to the treasure. Hey! Stay back! Stop that boy! Stop that boy! I will protect you. Death to Mara's enemies. They must be killed. Wait, wait, Pat, it's no use. They'll find us here. Hey, Dash, I have a loudspeaker rigged up in a tree. If we get to the mic, we can broadcast and stop them long enough for you to get to the temple. It's worth a try. We'll head for the temple. Good luck. Thanks. We'll need it. There they are! Let them all! Catch them before they get into the temple! Here you are, Pat. Now all you do is press the button and let her rip. I'll keep my fingers crossed. Your god, Mara, speaks. Do not be deceived by your enemy, Fang. This is the real voice of Mara. Mara speaks. Mara speaks, Mara speaks most. What went wrong? That was Pat Ryan's voice. He's rigged up a loudspeaker. Yeah, well, they've fallen for it anyway. Mara does not talk from a stone image, but from the spirit world above. I am the voice of Mara. It looks like Terry's scheme is working. Well, once I'm thankful, my people are superstitious. What you heard from my image was not the voice of Mara, but a devil machine placed there by Fang. That ought to get him. Get rid of that phonograph, and the statue of those natives will tear us to pieces. I'll circle around and find Ryan and silence him. Uncle. You have been tricked by Fang. The dragon lady is your rightful ruler. Look, my people, for proof of my words. The renegade Stanton is trying to remove the devil box. You heard? Morris right. <laughs> The run, Pat. Keep going. Mara is pleased. See that none escape. Get Fang and his pirates. Our God is good to us. Our enemies are being driven away. I'm worried about Pat and Terry. Oh, they're all right. I never heard Pat's voice sound stronger. You're going like a house of fire, Pat. I'm believing it myself. The dragon lady is your rightful ruler. Obey her in all things, and happiness and bountiful crops will follow you. Get you more power. Once Fang and his renegades are destroyed, peace will reign at the Temple of the Dawn. Fang is your only enemy. Listen, my people. Listen for your way of Ula. Listen. Shut up! 
cut your head off and it won't do you any good. I cut it off. Your Highness, the time has come for you to resume your place upon your throne. We must reassure our people. But wait, what about Pat and Terry? Pat is quit broadcasting. They're undoubtedly on the way here. I must hit me with a house. You almost made me say uncle, too. But our plan worked, didn't it, Pat? Your plan, Terry. Good boy. Hey, we better get back to the temple. I'll bet your dad's plenty worried. Oh, dad's used to that. I bet he's glad I'm not twins. Most of our men are wiped out. We're through. Oh, we mustn't quit. Hurry to Wing Po and force the governor to supply enough men to wipe out the temple guards and everyone there. It's the treasure we're after. That's right. Why not slip in and get it while the natives are running the boys down? Uh, do as I say. I will remain here until you return with more men. Don't try anything funny, Fang. I've worked too long on promises. Hurry, man. Get help. You can trust me. I will remain right here until you return. Turn to their senses. Thanks to you, Dr. Lee. No, thanks to Pat and Terry. It was their idea. <laughs> We've got them all on the run. I owe you much, my friend. Oh, enough, enough. We're not through yet. Fang won't give up so easily. He's sure to try and get his men together. But what shall I do? I think it wise to recall your people and place a heavy guard until Fang is caught. He is right. Sound the drums to recall the people at once. We must make plans for defense. Oh, hey, how about Connie and Stu? They helped us. They ought to celebrate, too. Thanks, men. Locked them in the cell when they took us out. Well, I'll get them pronto. Oh, wait a minute, Terry. You can't lose me. I was afraid of that. <laughs> we wait a long time. Hey, glad to see you. Yes, I know you fellows are glad to see us and all. What's the matter, Terry? Didn't Fang leave Crunch to dig out the treasure? Right. That's the first place they'll head for. We'll beat them to it. Connie, you and Big Stoop go into the throne room and tell the dragon lady and Dr. Lee that we're going to go into the treasure room and guard it until the temple guards return. Now, you wait with them. Do you understand? Sure. We do. Come on. Gee, what a job. That's big enough. Hey, wait a minute. Not that. We're both going together. It's the biggest diamond I ever saw. There must be more here. Come on, we'll show this to Fang. Yeah, but uh, come on, come on. Uh, I tell you, there must be more. He should have filled our pockets at least. Well, it can't get away. We showed this to the boss and he'll tear this place apart. Say, let me take another look at it, will you? Oh, boy. Ain't she a beauty? I'll take that diamond. Now, wait a minute. I'll let you on something. Fang and his men have been defeated. Now, if you hand me over that stolen diamond, I'll let you go. All right, come on, come on, give it to me. No! Message from Wang Pu. Boat arrived from Viceroy and Drake get aboard. The governor, 
Thompson. Everybody arrested. Soldiers on the way here. Guard this entrance. I'm going after the treasure. Let no one in. I'll give you your share of the treasure when I return. Yes, Master Fang. Bombo. Don't bother with him anymore. Let's get going. Now, where's the diamond? I got it. Hey, we better take that diamond to the boss. Why should we? Yeah, why should we? He doesn't know we have it. That's what I've been thinking all along. It's worth a fortune. Yeah. We'll keep it ourselves. Yeah! We beat it. With this, we never have a worry in the world. So you were going to rob me, were no, you? No, 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 no. It wasn't me, boss. Crunch tried to talk me into stealing it. I, I... I don't believe you. Nobody but me. Bumbo. Bumbo. Uh, so this is the end, Ryan. Our last meeting. You'll never cross my path again. Don't boast too soon, Fang. You'll never leave this temple. Those natives are no longer under your thumb. I care nothing for the natives. The temple treasure is mine. Ours, you mean, Fang. Oh, is that then? Yes. Yes, of course. Hand over that stone, you double-crosser. Hey, you're wrong, me, Stanton. I intended to divide with you. I don't believe you, and I'm not taking any chances. So hand it over now. Now, troublemaker, I'll finish with you. wasn't as good as Fang's. You haven't had as much practice. Boy, it was plenty good enough. Wait, I release Bombo and we go with you. No, you remain here. No, I go with you. I brought my friend of treasure too. Uh, very well. Miss Gorey, you get part of treasure. I'll give you your share now. You stay here. All for this. Well, Fang won't trouble us anymore. The gorilla avenged his keeper. We better give the others the news. Fang and his running gates are destroyed. Oh, you didn't have to... No, it had nothing to do with it. Maybe Mara took a hand. This diamond is part of the treasure he was after. Oh. I cannot find words to express my gratitude. Dr. Lee, you shall have free access to all our records. Swell, Dad. Your Highness, your people are eager to make amends. They wish to see you. You must come with me, my friends. It is due to all of you that this happy time is possible. My people, evil has departed. Thanks to our good friends, our enemies are destroyed. Our God is ours again. I, your queen, promise you all is well. Go to your homes in peace. Why, where's Terry? Why, he was here just a moment ago. Oh, look. 
There he is. Terry, what's the matter with you? Ah, shucks, Pat. There ain't gonna be any more fun around here. There's no one left to fight. <laughs> <laughs>